What's up you guys? My name is Sarah. I'm here with Teresa, Hi. my bestie, and we are at um, Rogue's Hollow in Chippewa, Ohio, I think, um, National Park, and um, we're here to try to see what we can find here. There is a crybaby bridge here, and the story has it that some lady threw her newborn baby into the river, and you can hear crying at night. What is that? <laughs> and, um, so... I've heard it once coming here at night before, and um, <clears throat> back in the day in the in the trails and stuff, there used to be a cabin that a witch lived in, and they tried to burn it because she was, you know, doing witchcraft and God only knows what, and it was taken out. A few years ago and uh, before it was taken out it was really a lot more activity going on here and um, there are sightings of a hellhound and the witch itself and um, there's supposed to be a headless horseman and I'm not too sure about that but you know, if people seen it, you know, could have happened. <laughs> this is weird to do videos. So, um, we're here going to explore a little bit. The witch's cabin is gone, but I have drove here at night with my husband, and um, I've seen shadow people, and I um. I've heard the barking of a hellhound, and there's no cars, no people around when you're driving on Clinton Road. Yeah, it's a Clinton Road, but it's not the Clinton Road that's, like, New Jersey, I think it is in. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> but, um, there is a picture of the witch pointing to go back, and... It's just weird out here. So let's explore, see what we can find. Okay. Oh, I've also heard a woman screaming. We'll go in that way. Yeah, we'll go in this way. Let's see what we can find here, you guys. How do I flip my camera around? <laughs> oh. Teresa's got a cold. Uh. I don't think I could flip my camera around at the same time. So. <laughs> There's a cat. I don't. can't flip my camera around. So here's some of the history around here. The old water uh, deal. So here's some of the stuff from back in the day. Eighteen ninety Doylestown in eighteen ninety. Empire Reaper. So that's a farming tool. Looks like some scary stuff in there. Like the Grim Reaper. Yeah, what, what the fuck is that thing? Empire Reaper. Man. There's a map of Rogue's Hollow. 
we're gonna try to do a spirit session spirit box I have um, necrophonics um, a lot of other youtubers use it like um, one of the reasons why I want to get into spirit uh, well ghost hunting oh yeah we're looking at the old stuff go ghost hunting because uh, I love watching Omar from Omar Gosh and CJ Fashion and uh, they inspire me. Oh, and Chris Starr, she, she's one of my favorites. So shout out to them for inspiring me to try to be a YouTuber and record this cool history. Look at the turtles over there. I know. <laughs> So I'm just starting out. This is technically my first video, you guys. So hopefully I can uh, get my name out there. I mean, I don't want to be known just to be known, you know. I want to make a difference in the world because I believe in uh, positive energy and negative energy and being uh, a light to people and just good vibes. So this place is probably closed, but it's really historic, and there's a, a poor kitty cat. I feel so bad for cats that live out here. It's a museum open each Sunday, June through September, so it's February, so it's not going to be open. Yeah, what's even uh, in there? Pro there's probably a historical stuff in there from... Uh, Um, I don't know. <laughs> I've never been in there, but we'll go in there when it opens. Yeah. Wait, what, what, when does it open? Uh, it opens June through September, so oh. it'll be open in the summer. We'll come here in the summer. Sweet. So, if you guys see or hear anything in my video, uh... Comment below and uh, tell me what you guys hear. Here's a map of it. Rogue's Hollow. Is there like a trail we can walk? Yeah, this trail. Park closed at the dark. Just some history. Look at that photo. That is weird. Well, that is a weird photo. It's so old. Yeah. So when I'm here, you guys, I feel like some kind of energy. I'm still trying to tap into my spiritual gifts. Um, I want to learn how to be sensitive to the spirits and learn what they're about and what when they're from why they're here yeah we'll go rogue's hollow trail loop so we're walking the trail <laughs> why don't they use caution for this? Because it's muddy and oh. uh, tree limbs and stuff. We probably should have worn better shoes. Yeah. Because <laughs> these are like brand new sketchers. Are they? Oh man. Uh. We should try to do a spirit session right here. So we should try to do a spirit session right here. Okay. This looks like a good area. I wonder how old this stuff is right here. Look at this stove. I wonder where the witch's cabin used to be. We need to be here with uh 
with Rick, so that way he'll know where it's at. Yeah. The sound re recorder app will uh, work. I don't know. So this is Necrophonics, and we're going to try to see if we can contact anybody or see if anyone wants to speak. But first of all, my name is Sarah, and this is Teresa, and we are protected by the light, and um, <clears throat> you're allowed to speak to us, but you are not allowed to follow us home. You are not allowed to attach to us. <clears throat> so, no negative energy is allowed to attach to us. No evil spirit is allowed to attach to us and follow us home. Is there anybody here that would like to speak to us? Is the child here from Crybaby Bridge? Or the woman that threw her baby in the river? Can you tell us your name? I just heard it come here. Who said come here? Me? Who is me? What is your name? I think I just heard somebody say asshole. I know, right? <laughs> Did you hear it? Yeah. <laughs> Is it true that there was a witch living in these woods? Can you imagine the history that's here and the people that walk through? Yeah. That's what I love about old places. You could just picture the thing. I could feel a presence here. Can you say your name? Speak one at a time, please. You guys are going way too much. I just heard the word Edna. What was the witch's name? I'm going to turn on airplane mode, you guys. See what if that makes a difference. So spirits can manipulate uh, energy, and so necrophonics is a spirit box that is about ten dollars on your app store, and it's like a spirit box, but it takes that ch -ch 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 noises out. And spirits manipulate the uh, energy and the frequencies that radio puts out to speak through the noise, speak through the stuff. I heard a David. Is that the name of the child that was thrown in the lake?
Can you say my name? Is there anyone that would like to speak to us? Speak clear into the phone. Use our energy to... That was weird. Use our energy to speak. You hear that train? I don't know. So there's a train in the background. I don't want to tell you the story, but there is a train track a couple miles from this park, and you can um, what's that? You see that in the woods back there? Oh, those are people. <laughs> so, um, this train track down the road. Uh, suppose, supposedly there's, um, <laughs> there's a ghost train, and, like, it's a passenger train that's not around anymore. Sorry, we're sick, so we sound like poopy. Yeah. <laughs> so, there's a train track, and you put your car on neutral, and you sit over the train track, and supposedly a bus full of kids crashed over there and um and the kids will push your car off the train train tracks and you will go uh well it's like level and then I'll have to show you guys one day and get out there and um but yeah you there's a ghost train and uh my husband has put flour on his car before, and uh, there was uh, like a non-human handprint on his car, along with a bunch of fingerprints before, and I wasn't there, so I want to test the stuff out myself and show you guys one day, so you want to keep walking? Sure. Okay. What is that? Is that a fruit loop? <laughs> <laughs> it looks like somebody karate chopped that table. <laughs> right. What <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? So, I love history and I love haunted history. So, um,. If you guys like my video, give a thumbs up and shout out to um, Omar Gosh TV and CJ Faison and Chris Star and other paranormal channels that I like to watch that inspired me to start doing something that I love and. Just comment below if you guys hear anything. So, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Which, this is one of my first videos, so I haven't named the channel yet. <laughs> so we'll figure that out. Did you hear that? Oh, there's a gun shooting. Uh, I hope it ain't. Yeah, there's the guns. There's gunshots going on right now. Sounded like a shotgun. Yeah. Somebody was shooting something in their backyard, hopefully, if they stay away. Yeah. Yeah. Dang, that's crazy. You sure that, that that's a gun? Yeah, that's a gun. That sounds like a shotgun to me. 
Maybe not. Maybe a handgun. I don't know. I don't know guns very well. <laughs> So, if you guys want to know where we're at, we're in, um, Doylestown, Ohio, and this park closes at, uh, dusk, and there's rumors that the ranger or the park owner lives here on site, and, um, he, uh, was caught in a fire. So, he's not, like, uh, I feel really bad that that happened to him. I hope it's not true. So, I like to seek truth in things, so that's why I'm kind of iffy on stuff. I wonder what these color arrows mean. Huh. So, there's another fire. You hear people. Let's go this way because it looks not bad. This is how I bet I have to record. Yay, so I can get a camera. Like, I like Omar and his videos, but he shows too much of himself sometimes. Yeah, I know. DJ, he's just a freak. I wonder where those people went. Ooh, there's a bridge over there. So, if you guys hear anything, if something is haunted, it's going to be haunted all the time. Not just at night. But, not much to see here except a bunch of trees. <laughs> One day we'll go to abandoned places and yeah, haunted that, places. So, this is awkward, but this is my outro video and, I mean my outro. Um... I'm still trying to figure a lot of things out, so I got to work on editing videos. I got to figure out how to edit and upload. So, um, I know this video was kind of everywhere and like, what the heck? So, they'll get better as I go. So, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, smash that like button, subscribe, and uh, put my name out there. Tell people I'm making videos. <laughs> um, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.